Hello everyone, welcome back to another video from Shomu's Biology. In this video lecture, we are going to talk about Staphylococcus aureus microbiology and the basics overview of Staphylococcus aureus. So let's start hopping in. The first thing that we want to talk about is the gram nature of Staphylococcus aureus and it is gram positive in nature. The second important feature is the diseases Staphylococcus aureus cause. There are a list of diseases it can cause and primarily the skin and soft tissue infections which are very common uh, for the Staphylococcus aureus. Okay, then respiratory infections can also be caused by Staphylococcus aureus. Food poisoning also can be caused by Staphylococcus aureus. Toxic shock syndrome (TSS) which is a very dangerous and deadly situation also caused by Staphylococcus aureus and more. It is one of the super dangerous uh, bacteria. Virulence factors. What are the virulence factors of Staphylococcus aureus? Uh, primarily protein A. Okay. Protein A binds to the antibodies of our immune defense and inhibits phagocytosis process. The second important virulence factor coagulases. Coagulase causes the blood clotting thus protecting the bacteria. Okay. The third important uh, virulence factor is endotoxins. Example, TSST1, which is a kind of enterotoxin. Enterotoxins primarily target our enteric tissues. That means our digestive tract, particularly the intestinal lining, epithelial cells of intestinal lining. Okay. And it causes tissue damage and symptoms in the host. Last is hemolysins. Hemolysins are a particular products which can damage red blood cells, destroy red blood cells. Okay. These are all virulence factors of Staphylococcus aureus. What are the incubation period of Staph aureus? You know, Staph aureus infections variable typically few hours to even few days. What are the antibiotic susceptibility? There are some antibiotics which can kill Staphylococcus aureus. Uh, like uh, uh, there are some very, very few, but they are an increasing resistance of Staphylococcus aureus to even methicillin and other beta-lactam antibiotics. Antibiotic uh, resistance, if we talk about, obviously it's increasing, known as commonly associated with MRSA stain, known as methicillin resistant Staphylococcus aureus, also known as superbug, methicillin resistant. Methicillin is a kind of beta-lactam antibiotic and this antibiotic is even uh, the, the recent kind of uh, beta-lactam variant of antibiotic, but still, the, there are some Staphylococcus aureus which can bypass the activity of this uh, methicillin. So, they are MRSA strain. What about the culture method? What culture method we can use to culture Staphylococcus aureus grows on standardized culture, culture media that is a blood agar media that we can use. It forms characteristics colonies and identified by the gram staining method with which we can easily get to know about the colony whether the colony is from, formed by the Staphylococcus aureus or by any other Staphylococcus bacteria. What are the detection method that we use? Uh, the detection method, there are three. The first one is the gram staining method, which uh, identifies the gram positive cocci in the cluster shape. That is something, but it's not 100% confirmatory. The second step that we use, the second method that we use a blood culture method, uh, where we do the blood agar culture. So, so we, we take the blood from the uh, the host, the patient, and we culture that. We, if, we, if there is Staphylococcus aureus in the blood sample, it will be detected in the culture by looking at a specifically designed characteristic colonies. And the third important detection method is PCR, polymerase chain reaction, where uh, this is a molecular method for detecting the presence of specific uh, structures or, or nucleic acid component of uh, the Staphylococcus aureus in the medium. Okay, so that's all regarding Staphylococcus aureus, and this is one of the super bug that is available if you are infected by the MRSA, methicillin resistant Staphylococcus aureus. It would be very dangerous. So be aware. So that's all about it. If you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends, subscribe to get more videos like this in future. Thank you. Bye.